how are you today? I am so glad to hear it. My friend Sally and I are doing just great. How about you and I sing our welcome song and then we'll see you right back here. Are you ready? Here we go. Hi boys and girls, are you ready to learn? Welcome to Salamander Clubhouse, where learning is fun. Hello, hello, and welcome to you. Hello, hello, and how do you do? How are you today? Learning is fun. Let's have some All fun. you have to do is try. You can do it. Happy faces on, big smiles. Big smiles. You can do it if you try. Come along and learn with me. Miss Lou. That was fun and I hope that you feel very welcome here in Salamander Clubhouse. Right now, we're going to start off our day with the alphabet. And I am going to sign the alphabet while I sing the alphabet and you are welcome to join and try to sign as well. Are you ready? All right, here we go. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time won't you sing with me? I think you already did. My friend Sally said she thinks you did a great job. I'm so happy that you're here and that you're trying. All right, Sally. She's got something to do while we continue our work for today. Bye for now, Sally. Well, today, friends, I have a very special letter for you. And did you know it's the final, last ending of the alphabet segment? Do you know what letter comes at the end of the alphabet? Hmm comes right after Y. I have a clue for you. All right, are you ready? It's one of my funny, funny, funny clues. <gasps> and it's my hat, my special hat with the letter. That's right, the letter for today is Z uppercase and lowercase. All right, I'm gonna keep my silly hat on today. And there's another reason why I have my hat on and why my hat is white and black and why my top has stripes. Hmm, what could that mean? Well, let's think of some words that start with the letter Z. Hmm, Z, Z, I know. Zipper. Zipper starts with the letter Z. And, very special animal. Do you know what it is? Hmm, hmm. I think I heard you say it out loud. You're right, it's a zebra. Zebra starts with the letter Z. And guess what? Zebras have stripes, just like me. Today, we are going to practice printing the letter Z and we're going to read a fabulous poem about zebras. But before we do that, I thought we might like to sing a song about the days of the week. 
Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Do you know a song about the days of the week? I do. And I think that we can learn this one together. Are you ready? It goes like this. There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. 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 Great job! Let's try that again. There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. 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 You just got the hang of it. Thank you for singing with me. All right, it's time for us to practice the letter C. And we're going to print, then we're going to read a poem, and then we're going to play I Spy. Are you ready? Here we go. All right, friends, I have a marker today, and I have my letters all started with dots. It doesn't matter what you have. You can do it in the air. If you have a whiteboard, you can print your letters there. If you have a sandbox, you can print in your sandbox or with crayons and paper, anything you have. All right, remember that we start at the top, but this letter does not go from top to bottom right away. It goes to the side. Are you ready to follow along? Here we go, starting with the uppercase Z at the top. Across, diagonal, and across again, just like that. Across, diagonal, and across again. You are doing a great job. We don't take our pen off the paper for this one. Right across, Z. And now we're going to do lowercase. And it's exactly the same. It just takes up half the space. A little tiny Z. Just like that. Don't worry if you don't get it right away. You will catch on across, diagonal, and straight across. And we have a word for you today. Zebra. Zebra. Kind of like me. I also have two more words for you. One is zigzag. And the other one is the number zero. Zero and zigzag start with the letter Z. Are you ready to read our poem about a zebra? All right, here we go. All right, we are just about to start a very interesting poem about a zebra. Lots to learn here. Are you ready to follow along? And if you have a pointer, please feel free to follow the words. Okay, here we go. Every zebra has a unique pattern of stripes. Nothing duplicated. You will see a pattern only once, not twice. Standing up is how a zebra sleeps. Yes, that's right, up on their feet. They eat grass, shrubs, herbs, twigs, and leaves. Yes, it's true, they prefer greens. A group of zebras is called a dazzle or a zeal. Have you heard of such a thing? It's actually real. Zebras are amazing animals. Of that there is no doubt. Look at all the zebra facts you just learned about. Wow, zebras are pretty neat animals, aren't they? 
how about you and I play I spy all the letter Z's that we see in our poem. Are you ready to count? Here we go. I spy one. Hmm. I spy two. Let's see if there are any more letter Z's. I spy three and four and five and six. I spy seven, eight, and nine letter Z's. That was fun. You did a great job, friends. Wow, what a wonderful day we had together. I really enjoyed that. We learned all about the letter Z and zebras and words like zipper and zigzag and zero. Great job, friends. Now it's time for us to say goodbye, but we'll see you soon right here in Salamander Clubhouse. Are you ready to sing our goodbye song? Here we go. See you later, alligator, in a wild crocodile. Give a hug, ladybug, blow a kiss, jellyfish. See you soon, big baboon, out the door, dinosaur. Take care, polar bear, wave goodbye, butterfly. Thank you for joining me and our friend Sally right here in Salamander Clubhouse. See you soon, friends. Bye-bye.